Ah, uh, good morning, class. So here we are. It is Friday, and uh, sorry I had my couple of days off here, but Shane is here with me because today is his day in class with me, and he's going to give me a little how-to, uh, help me get a little how-to video on how we go about sheeting our walls now. Um, you guys all had a chance to be in class with me and frame the walls up. That's only half the battle. Uh, we have no clue whether our walls are square or not and uh, we got to get plywood on them. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over that process. And if you guys can remember, we still, we want to be working around this wall from the bottom up. And because most of us are right-handed, let's go counterclockwise around it. And uh, what you're going to notice first, before we go and nail everything off, follow the steps that we've got to take here. Before we nail everything off, we're going to tack everything in place, make sure that it's square. We'll have to cut out for our window and our door holes and whatnot and uh, pay very close attention to how the layout works. So uh, here we go, I'm gonna flip us around here. And I got Shane waiting with his hammer and nails right here and I got our wall sitting down here with the first sheet of plywood on. First thing I want you guys to know is Shane, pull out your tape measure and show me the layout across the bottom right here, what we got. Whoa, it's falling. Okay, hook on it. Look down here guys. The 16 is in the center of my stud. 32 is in about the center of the stud. Shane, go a little bit farther. The 48 is in the center of the stud. Now notice, had I started, and I started this stud right here at 16 inches and go, so the stud would be over here, my plywood would not be breaking because by the time I get over here at 48, the stud would be over here and my plywood wouldn't work. This piece of plywood we're laying down is only four feet and we want it coming all the way out to the corner. So as we start this, Shane, well, as we get started here, if you look, you can see all four edges of our plywood are all painted orange. Those are factory edges that have not been cut. So I know this is a perfectly square, uncut, four foot by eight foot sheet of plywood. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start down here and we're gonna get this corner lined up first. Shane, I'll help you up top here, get that corner lined up flush. And what Shane's gonna do is he's gonna make sure it's flush with our wall plate right here. Not necessarily the stud, but it's flush with the wall plate. And it's also, I can just see the roll, roll of this two by four right here. There's a little bit of a reveal, okay? I don't want this plywood completely down even with this because I don't want it holding us off the floor. But as you can see here, we are nice and flush with the plate. So Shane, drive an eight penny nail into that real quick so it stays right where it's at. Notice, we're starting at the bottom plate, working at the bottom. Straight down. And drive it home, man. Okay, now what he's gonna do is he's gonna come over here to about the middle. He wants to make sure that that reveal up off of the, uh, the floor is totally even. So Shane, get one right in the middle at about two feet right there because the reveal looks real good. Drive it straight in there. Don't point it at me. There you go. Okay, he tacked it in. Uh-oh, look at guys, we get over to this side. That's actually hanging down on the bottom. Okay, this is why it's a two-person job. I can stand here. I can help Shane, I can do this. Look at that, just by me you know, popping my foot down on that, I get the exact same reveal that I need. Shane, don't hit my toe, but nail me in in the corner right there. All right, our bottom is set, you guys. Now we get to look all the way up the edge of the stud. I have a nice even reveal. It breaks right in the middle of the stud here, up, up into our window opening, and I look up here, I'm breaking right in the middle of the stud. I don't care about over there. What I care about now is my perfectly square sheet of plywood running all the way up and being flush with my top plate up here. It looks like it's hanging out just a little tiny bit. So all Shane's got to do is probably start your nails, Shane. Just get it started. Okay, Shane's nails started. I'll take my foot, come right over here, kick that back. Oh, that's way too much. But this looks like it's pretty darn close. Right here, it would come up and plane right through the edge of my wall plate right there. That looks square. If I double check it over here, it's still in the middle of a stud. Shane, nail it off. All right, last thing we gotta do. We gotta come down here in the middle of our stud. Nothing's nailed here. Look at the, uh-oh, what am I gonna do about that? Not a good, not a good situation. Um, let me stop in one second.